What's the fastest way to become a millionaire? Well, before we get to actually answering that question, I have to ask you a question. Do you think it's more important to have results goals or progress goals? I always ask this question because it gets you in the right mindset in order for you to actually think like a millionaire. Now, results goals are, for example, uh, how can I become a millionaire in one to five years? Well, progress goals talk about the steps that you have to do in order to actually achieve that goal. So for example, if you want to own $1 million worth of real estate or have a business worth $1 million, there are certain steps or progress goals that you have to do in order to get there. For real estate, it would be, I have to make a thousand phone calls in order for me to close on one house. So if by measuring out the 1,000 goals and 1,000 phone calls and breaking that down into steps for your daily tasks, you'll be able to achieve the million dollar goal or result goal by the end. Now I also want to make sure that you understand how important it is to realize that a lot of people will overestimate what they can do in one year, but underestimate what they can do in five years. And what that means is, Generally speaking, we'll set a goal that's so large, for example, I have to lose 25 pounds by the end of the year, or buy one, or be a millionaire by the end of the year. Now that could be a little bit more of a stretch goal than what you're able to actually do. So you end up getting upset or defensive, or you slow down because you actually don't get the result by the end of the year. Now on the other side of the coin, in five years, if you said you want to be a millionaire in five years, well, it's likely you could probably reach it within two to four years, but you set the goal out too far. Now, by setting the goal out too far, you get out the, you get out the gate a little slower than what you actually need to do in order to make the result happen. Now, some of the best advice that I've ever had with becoming a millionaire comes down to actually surrounding yourself with people that will help you achieve that. Your network is your net worth. If you're surrounding yourself with people that aren't millionaires, you'll be thinking like people that are not millionaires. But when you start to surround yourself with people that have already achieved it, they will leave success breadcrumbs. In other words, they will be able to guide you from the pitfalls and the decisions that they made that resulted in dumb taxes or tuition. For every mistake that a millionaire made, if you can shorten that path of your learning progress, you'll be able to get there much faster. Now, if you're wondering what are the industries that are allow you to become a millionaire the fastest, real estate has always been one of the fastest growing niches when it comes to wealth. Whether that means being a real estate agent or broker, or being in the finance side of financing the deals, real estate is one of the best widely known million dollar paths. Now for more information, I'm happy to share different tips and tricks. Go ahead and schedule a free call or coaching call with me and I'll discuss different ways that you can actually become a millionaire.